First Reformed Church is a almost 300 year old congregation. The congregation itself saw that there was a great need to repurpose the interior of the sanctuary, but they couldn't do it on their own. So a board was formed from members of the church as well as members of the community. And the CDCs can apply for funding that the church as a religious entity otherwise would not be eligible to apply for. We are partnering with Women Aware and they are very established in our community for providing emergency services for victims of domestic violence. They just don't have the permanent housing and we're gonna be able to provide that piece. The biggest problem though that New Brunswick has is that there's not a lot of affordable housing for people and that is difficult. So we're able to adapt this space to include all of the things that we care about and that are still historic, but make them that they're in a new way more useful and can offer more groups usage of the interior of the sanctuary. What we are doing is to oversee the redesign of the interior of the sanctuary building which would then include affordable housing for women and children, flexible community space that supports artistic expression, to include other building enhancements that will support expanded, accessible space for the community to gather, and to be environmentally more efficient. By repurposing the interior of the sanctuary, the actual building itself becomes real mission work. So it, it ends up becoming a blessing to people who really need space to live. This is a real opportunity for new types of ministries to be created in, in the space and that it's, it will be transformed into something really that's a blessing for many. I hope that we bring hope to women and their families that we provide a, a, a service to our community. We would like to change education to, to men and boys, that they don't need to be violent, that they could find another way to deal with their anger or their hurt, um, not beat up on their wives and their children. So I, I would hope we would bring some hope to this community. The, the worst thing would be for us to stand still and not do something innovative. You know? Just thinking that this space will be able to house 10 women in a safe environment inspires me because I, I'm thrilled that it, it will be a real sanctuary in all the sense of the word.